Hi guys, how's it going? This is Laura and welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today's video is going to be how to pose like a model and even if you're not a model. So a little backstory, my name is Laura and I've been modeling in Japan for about six years now. Prior to that I actually was doing photography for a very long time. Having that experience behind the camera and then going on to do modeling really did help me understand a certain few things and this video will also not just help you if you're doing modeling, planning to do modeling as your career, but I think also in your everyday use such as with family, friends reunion, weddings, any kind of like situation. It's just always nice to kind of like look nice in photos and there are small things that you can do that really make a huge difference. Okay and so to do this video today I have a special guest, Riona chan <laughs> Hi, I'm Riona. Thank you for having me. Thank you for coming today. If you guys um, haven't watched BuzzFeed Japan, Riona appears in it and I really really love watching Riona because Aww. she's so funny. Okay, so let's start. I have four tips to teach you. You have no idea about modeling or no, posing. No, absolutely not. Oh yeah, so you don't post that much on your Instagram. I right? do not. I do not. So <laughs> I'm hoping that with these tips that like Riona will mm -hmm. finally post photos more often on Instagram. So <laughs> number one is angles. Do you know like what's your best angles? Obviously you... not from like below. Like when I'm using my phone and then it suddenly it goes to like a black photo or something and I can like I can see myself and I'm like <laughs> I think a lot of people don't look good. <laughs> it's so scary. It's like I never knew that that's how the bottom of my chin looked like. I don't think anybody wants to see that. <laughs> when it comes to modeling they tell you a lot like lower your chin a little oh. bit only a little bit, only a little bit, but like you look into the camera. If your face is just like normal, mm -hmm. I mean obviously I'm not in a photo, but <laughs> I actually have quite a hexagonal face. Yep. So just like tuck a little bit and then if you look into the camera, <laughs> you it will actually will look better. We'll practice it oh, really? soon. Another one mm -hmm. is like three quarters. Again you tuck in your chin a little bit and you just turn your face to the side. A little so wait, let's let's there we go. Look at the guy camera. Okay. <laughs> Chin down and then a little bit to the side, like a face like this, and then look at the camera. I mean you're ruining this. I mean you're ruining this. The second one <laughs> is hands. Uh -huh. And I noticed oh, that you were like, what hands are you? <laughs> It's not hand modeling. Okay, I was like... It's just, usually people forget about hands mm -hmm. when they're modeling because they feel kind of awkward. You can really make a photo look powerful when you have like... I, I always pose like wow. this, uh -huh. something like this or like this. Wait, I'm gonna show you so you can have an idea mm -hmm. what I'm talking about. And I'll just put it up on. So, the classic hand in the pocket. Oh, nice! Okay. okay. Wow. <laughs> I think what helps as well if you like maybe put like your hand like this. This is a good powerful shot. Like if you want to like show like power and confidence. <laughs> okay. It's like this. Yeah. My fingers like this is just like baby hand. It's so soft. It's so warm. <laughs> I'm always so cold. <laughs> Look at my tips. <laughs> the third one is just in general like posing. Mm -hmm. When I do my jobs, yeah. I actually always have at least six different poses really? already. Wow. That's like, especially because I do a lot of clothing. Mm -hmm. And trust me, when you're doing 200 clothes in a day. <laughs> wow. 200? Yeah. Change. Like, like a robot. Oh, no. Like, there's benefits. Like, I've learned how to change my clothes really fast. <laughs> <laughs> there's a lot of poses that can make you look taller and really? slimmer. Mm -hmm. These are tricks that I've been using for like years. And it's so crazy because people think that I'm like super oh. tall. And then they look at me and they're like, you're so tiny. <laughs> I look tall in my photos actually. Oh. I don't post photos of like my whole body. Mm, that's also a good one. Yeah. Like up to here. Actually, I don't actually post the photos. <laughs> so like, in general, I don't post photos. We are going to change that today. <laughs> the last tip mm -hmm. is inspiration. Yep. Yeah. So it's always important to look at other 
maybe models or something not just your stereotypical model like mm -hmm. usually I of course like you know I think Bella Hadid, Gigi Hadid are amazing they're super tall and I'm not that tall like I don't have two meters of legs uh -huh. you know there's like this photo that she's in her bikini hold on this one I was like dude how does that happen half the photo <laughs> is her legs yeah you can look at them for like, inspiration yeah. because they pose professionally but also look at people that kind of like also resemble maybe similar yeah. body types. Mm -hmm. I did this a lot when I started my career because I knew that Kiko Mizuhara and Rora, mm -hmm. they're like exactly the same height as oh, me. Oh, really? Yeah. Photos, mm -hmm. I could just see like how did they pose? Mm -hmm. How are they making themselves look so tall or slim? Because there's like ways that you can pose your leg that makes your legs look just Because of like the shadows? The angle. Like it's a it's like an illusion mm -hmm. kind of thing. Mm -hmm. I feel like when you know how your body is going to look, mm -hmm. you feel more confident. Yeah. I don't know. Do you have any like people that inspire you obviously you inspired me for one photo i'll put that photo right here um, <laughs> i do look at plus size models i actually look at this girl called jasmine oh wow look at that powerful hand oh yeah you see look at that powerful hand i love how she's so confident with her like body because like i never see this in japanese culture oh. i can never find japanese plus size model or like a curvy girl that i'm like inspired by because it's kind of like a taboo to like show skin mm -hmm. or like boobs yeah that's for true. a photo in japan location and um, I'm going to shoot Rihanna now with some of the tips. Sometimes if you feel a little bit nervous what I do is I always look down a little bit and then look up like that. You can always feel a little bit tense you know especially if you're like holding the pose for a long time you end up especially if you're smiling as well for a shoot you're like you smile there's a bit weird. You're doing fine sweetie. You're doing fine. Mom. Mom. <laughs> So if your location has areas you can rest on, just, you know, rest like these, like this. And then like the little tippy toes. Okay. Nice, I like it. I like how you use that down. This next pose that I'm going to suggest is one that I often use to make me like look longer. Um, and it's, so, it make your legs look longer. So the camera has to be a little bit like, that's it. Ooh, you look really good. Sorry. You look so much taller. Yeah. Uh. Oh, that's nice. Ready? Oh, Yeah, it looks so good. Wow. The final thing is we're gonna do. Like, she's gonna copy this pose, and we're gonna try get a photo just like. That. You wanna make sure it's kind of like this. Mechai, <gasps> honto. Can I have you like put your chin a little bit down? Actually, put your that arm in the pocket. Oh, that one's really nice too. Yeah. It's a bit dark. Lighting a bit nice. But the most important thing is to have fun because yeah. if you're not enjoying yourself, it's actually going to reflect on the images. Yeah. You know, you're going to see that you're tense, nervous, and the best thing to do, honestly, is put a little bit of music, shake it out a little bit, and up. I hope these tips really do like help. Yeah. yeah. Thank you, Rihanna. Thank you. So that was the video, guys. I hope you've learned a lot. I hope, <laughs> you hope you've learned a lot. I hope that you'll be posting more photos. I will be posting the photo. Yes, that we take today. Definitely. Thank you really so much yeah. for coming. Mm -hmm. And I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you have any questions or want to leave a comment, leave it down below. Don't forget to follow Riona and then me and subscribe. And bye. Bye. <laughs> Oh god, I forgot to change the camera. Oh look, there's that classic shot. Hey, <laughs>